All right, the American Dream Dusty Rhodes special challenge match right here. World Heavyweight Champion, Nature Boy Ric Flair, Kendo Wyndham, and Jim Ross, you and I were talking just a moment ago. The champ certainly can't take this young man lightly. He certainly can't. Kendo Wyndham, a second generation wrestler, former Florida heavyweight champion. Uh, he's got a, a comes from a great wrestling family, got a, a great heritage, and and Ric Flair, a little surprising gesture there, Bob, with a good sportsmanlike uh, handshake with young Kendall Wyndham in this great matchup here on the Wrestling Network. And the champ down as he hits the mat first as Wyndham came charging off of the ropes at him. And I think right away now that Ric Flair, you can look in his eyes and see that he's got a lot more respect for this young man in a hurry. I want to mention one other thing, too, Jim. The American Dream, Dusty Rhodes, we heard from him just a few moments ago, and all we know is that Dusty says he's committed to the bunkhouse stampedes. Past that, we don't know anything about Dusty Rhodes. That's the only statement that he has made thus far. And now the, a man that has made a lot of statements recently is the man we're seeing right there, Nature Boy Ric Flair. Uh, and he has a lot to crow about because he made a statement that he was going to become the five times heavyweight champion of the world, and he did it. Enough said there. He's got to go down in the books. He's got to go down in the wrestling history books about that five-time world heavyweight champion, Nature Boy Ric Flair. Good hip toss right there by Kendall Wyndham. Ric Flair seems to be, at this point in time, a little bit frustrated, and you hate to think you want to think for someone but you hate to think that flair has stepped into this ring maybe somewhat preoccupied with all the controversy surrounding the four horsemen could be. perhaps well could be. perhaps that is what we're seeing here that man i'm sure jj dillon is, is very deeply concerned about not only what's going on in the ring but what is going on four in, in the in the background behind the scenes I'd like to be a mouse in the corner here, so that the, the discussion is there. Uh, uh, Jim, you're right. And I'll tell you, we've been trying to find out more and more, and I tell you, they're all very close-mouthed about it. Exactly right. And Kendall Wyndham with a great offensive move. And Kendall Wyndham has, has really progressed a great deal in 1987. And I think 1988 is going to be a, a great year for Kendall Wyndham. He's a young man that I don't think has reached his potential yet. We, we have yet to see his best days, and that's what's exciting about the National Wrestling Alliance. So many great young stars that we'll see improve each and every week. Right. The better days yet to come, and you're going to see them improve. I'm sure you're going to see them improve from week to week. Oh. Wyndham just may be the type of individual. His flair's got him in the corner, hacking away at him with those chops, but Wyndham may be the type of individual, Jim, that can really give the champ trouble. He's very tall, and that height with that... It gives him some Center extra leverage. gravity, yeah, and that, that may have a little, give, be giving the champion a little bit of trouble. Wyndham reverses high elevation, great drop kick. And the heavyweight champion of the world, I think it's somewhat of a surprising result thus far, and I'm not, I don't want to take anything away from oh, Kendall no. Wyndham, but I'm trying to say that Ric Flair is perhaps the greatest this sport has ever known. And Kendall Wyndham is giving him a great contest right here on the Wrestling Network. Flair is such a master tactician. Well, he came right in, got the knee right up, and he could turn it around on you in just a flash, and that's exactly what he did to Wyndham. But he missed that knee drop. Off of the ropes, he timed it just perfectly. Wyndham then set him up for the figure four, and Flair kicked off. Now he's caught. He may try to turn him over into the Boston Crab, and that's exactly what he's done here. Wyndham with that leverage, he'll have the advantage in that department for sure. A look at determination on Kendall Wyndham. Right there, you see it. And Ric Flair reaching for the sanctuary of the ropes. He's headed that way. That's about his only salvation at this point is to get to the ropes, make the referee break it, and that's what happened. But the champ is in pain, believe me. And that Boston Crab puts a great deal of pressure on your lower back. Now we'll see if Kendall Wyndham has the, the expertise to capitalize on what he's already done here. You better believe the four horsemen, if they get you hurt like Wyndham did the champ, they're going to go right back at it. They're going to stay on that spot, and they're going to work you over. Oh, he comes with a suplex. Beautiful move on the part of the youngster. And the point of attack is that back. And fans, right now, the action in the ring will continue. Don't go away. We'll have more of this bout when we come back right after this. As we come back to action in the ring, Kendo Wyndham back to the corner by the champion, and he can really cut you with those chops, Jim. Uh, he's, he's very physical with a nice reverse by Kendo Wyndham into the sleeper. Wyndham with a leverage advantage. He's over the top of Flair. He's got the advantage there, and he's got the sleeper in the center of the ring on the heavyweight champion of the world. How's the champion going to get out of this?
this. As you said, near the center of the ring, it's a long way to the ropes. Wendell's got those long arms wrapped around Flair. He's got the sleep, sleeper really locked in. And Wendell, look at the determination, Bob on his face. The younger Flair. brother of Barry Wendell really bearing down. Up with a suplex. The only way Flair could get out of that one, and he managed to get the leverage to do it. As he reached down, got Wyndham in that suplex, pounds him to the mat. Now they're both groggy. Flair maneuvered himself around. He got it. Wyndham returned the uh, sleeper into a headlock. And then Flair bellied the back, suplexed him, and planted him. And now the, the rangy youngster that was the challenging the NWA champion is feeling the wrath of the leader of the four horsemen. Great move! Great move by Kendall Wyndham of Flair. He couldn't take him over, Bob. Well, the champion that he is, he blocked that move. It was a good move on the part of Wyndham, but Ric Flair, ever thinking in a ring, managed to block it. You don't be five-time world champion, Jim, unless you got a lot on the ball, and Flair's got it. There's a reversal. Can he hold both arms down? Count of two. Man, we got a, that was a that was a near fall. I, we're talking a Boy, very, two and a half. We came very close to seeing the world champion pin. Boy, Flair can chop you. You can hear him just echo around the arena. Wendell with that left hand now backs him across the ring. And the winner try exchanging blows with the heavyweight champion of the world. He has stood toe to toe with him, and he's given just as much as he's taken. Standing drop kick by the youngster from Sweetwater, Texas. Boy, he's so full of emotion. Wow. Oh. Out of the corner, Flair cut that flip. Flair went head first into the center turnbuckle up and over the ropes. But he's right back on his feet. That shows you the tremendous resiliency. And resourcefulness. we got the inside cradle. Just when Flair started to pick him up, Wendell blocked it. Came with that cradle, but again, he couldn't hold him. Ducked under that shot. Close line. That Wyndham Lariat. You got to hand it to Kendall Wyndham. We're seeing a great young athlete here. He went for the drop kick off the top rope, but the experience of the champion, he moved out of the way, and Wyndham went full force right off the top rope on his back. Flair is going to go for the figure four. Flair reversed the inside cradle to one of his own, and we've got a winner. The heavyweight champion of the world with a winner, with a win here. But a great effort by Kendall Wyndham. What a great match it was. The winner, the world champion.